In 2016, Tony Stewart called an end to his illustrious first-class racing career in NASCAR, but the charismatic team boss's passion for the dirt track has kept him busier than ever. I was excited about my NASCAR career, obviously, and, and what I did there, but I just really had that desire to come back and, and start racing on the dirt before I got too old. Everybody says I quote unquote retired. All I did was just quit driving in NASCAR and went back to racing on dirt. Racing more than I've ever raced. I got 99 races on my schedule this year. So it's pretty aggressive and pretty much every weekend from the last weekend in January through the second weekend of November, pretty much every weekend I'm racing somewhere in the country. Whilst keeping an eye on his NASCAR team, Stewart owns and races in the All-Star Circuit of Champions alongside the world of Outlaws with his sprint car team, TSR. The All-Star Circuit of Champions series that I own is basically more of a regional series. So we race up in the Northeast as far as New York, down through Pennsylvania, Ohio, West Virginia, Indiana, Illinois, Wisconsin, but it's more regional versus like the World of Outlaws that literally race all the way up in the Northeast, the Southeast, and all the way out to the Northwest and Southwest. So they cover everywhere in the United States where we're more just a regional series. I'm running a wing sprint car. Some of the races are in 360 cubic inch motors, and the majority of them are in 410 cubic inch motors. It's a 1,200 pound car that produces uh, over 900 horsepower. It, it's, it's really quick. At TSR, Stewart has a legend of the dirt track at his side in Donny Schatz. The 10-time Outlaw champion paired with Tony Stewart racing in 2008, and they've never looked back. It's always fun to have him around. He's got very good insight. He's probably one of the best guys to get in these cars, and his feedback over the years has helped me a ton just because of his relationship with NASCAR and how they do some of the testing. So he's doing his thing and enjoying his retirement, but it seems like it's not really retirement. It seems like he's going, going harder now than he was before. While Stewart pursues his passion on the dirt, his NASCAR powerhouse SHR remains a key focus on his schedule. It's having the right people in the right places that you know can handle the job so I don't have to sit there and worry about it on a daily basis and when I need to know what's going on they call me and it's literally just two or three phone calls and I know exactly what's going on with the entire company. So having that confidence and those key people to, to do the right jobs makes my job a lot easier. The 48-year-old is having a great sprint car season with nine wins already. And with three of his SHR drivers securing a spot in the NASCAR Cup playoffs, it seems Smoke is having a stellar year. There's so much stacked on the plate right now. I don't know that I can add anything else to it, to be honest. But the stuff that I have going on is a lot of fun. I really enjoy my involvement with SHR, with Eldora, with the other two dirt tracks that I'm involved in, and obviously with the World of Outlaw Series and All-Star Series. It's enough to keep you busy and make you, at the end of the day, check your sanity because there's just a lot going on all the time.